Welcome and welcome back to my channel. I am Nikki. I am Nicole and you are watching life with Nikki Nicole and welcome back to Another day in my life. Welcome back to the vlog you guys. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day It is Thursday Thursday July 22nd And I am Out and about just about to run a fruit errors y'all um and i just thought i would come on in and start a vlog by the time you see this this vlog hopefully we are fully caught up on our vlogs and we are doing vlogs in real time close to real time anyways but anyway you guys so y'all know me i'm under this garage i'm trying to get from under here but i am headed i need a i'm headed to run some errands y'all i gotta go to the store of course and pick up a few things but then also i am in need i really need a new phone so i'm going to see if i can upgrade my phone and i have been having problems out this phone ever since i went home one weekend and i ended up leaving it on top of my sister's car and it got it fell and got ran over it was damaged really bad even though we found the phone and i was able to get the screen fixed um when, when they fixed the screen the um the camera was not working the back camera was not working so i took it back and they call itself fixing the camera but ever since they did that every time i try to use the back camera it's either really blurry and staticky or you, even though i'm recording you all you hear is static i can't zoom in if i zoom in or anything like that it's really bad so and i use my phone to vlog with it is what it is That's it's causing problems with me because when I be trying to vlog and do what I need to do, I can't because I need to use my camera. So I'm gonna go this way. I don't even, y'all. I'm talking to y'all. I know I need this GPS. I don't know. I don't know where I'm going. But anyway, you guys. So I'm gonna go and see what my options are and see if I will be able to upgrade. Um, however, if not, we're gonna do what we can do till we can do what we can do. Then I need to make another stop. Um, I'm debating on whether or not I'm gonna cook tonight. I just asked the girls what they wanted. Um, and they're not sure, so we'll see. But anyways, I do have to make a stop and pick up a few household things that we're running out of. And um, yeah, so this is what our day is consisted of. Nothing big, nothing special. I might um, go to Ross because it's something that I want from there that I saw Saturday when I was out with my daughter, but I'm not for sure if, they st if it's still there or not. Um, but then other than that, I think that's it. To the phone place, to um, Walmart. I'm gonna also pick up a, a couple of groceries too. So that's what the day consists of, y'all. And I picked the wrong time to get out. I should have been out earlier this morning. It's 3 06. So y'all already know what this traffic about to be about. So let me get off here so I can use this GPS so I can um, follow the GPS to get to where I need to go. And um, yeah, I'm gonna come back and talk to y'all later. Peace. Hey you guys, so I am back y'all. Getting ready to go in to run into Marshalls right quick. Um, because when I was here Saturday with my daughter, there was a fragrance that um, I smelled that smelled really good on me even after the fact. So I'm going to pick this up. It's called Emerald. It smelled really good. I hope they still have it. But y'all, I didn't do the upgrade. Um, but I did um, find out what my options are in order um, to upgrade. So I know what I need to do. Um, so yeah, didn't do the upgrade today. But eventually it will get done. Because I definitely am going to have to upgrade. So anyway, you guys, I'm about to run into Marshalls really quick. And yeah, let's go. What's up, you guys? So I am back. I am sorry about the the way I'm filming right now, but it is what it is. I'm in, uh, never mind. Getting ready to leave Marshalls, you guys. I did pick up a few things, so guess I'm gonna try to do a haul when we get back to the house. Y'all, my daughter keep calling me talking about where I'm at. I'm spending time with me today. Like, I just had to get up and just get out, y'all, because I've been, it's been so hot. I don't know, y'all, this Dallas weather, it's been so hot that I just been in the house, but I decided to, you know, get out for a few minutes. Just, you know, do some little things for myself. Um, 
And so, like I told you, I went in Marshalls for a certain fragrance, but it was gone. And I and I can understand why because it smelled really good. They had the the soft that was emerald sapphire and pearl. They had the sapphire and the pearl, the sapphire. I'm so country. Sapphire and the pearl. The sapphire it was okay, and the pearl it was it smelled good, but it was like a really really soft soft scent. So I didn't get that, but I did um, pick up two other fragrances. One of them you can't never go wrong with to me. And then, um, so I did pick up two fragrances and a couple of other things. And I'm gonna show you guys that later. I'm about to run in Ross really quick. And then we're gonna head to Walmart. Ross is right across the street from where I'm at. So we might as well. I'm gonna try my best just to go in there for what I'm looking for. Something I seen that I want for myself. And you know, I just got a little odds and ends for myself, you guys. And um, yeah, so I'm gonna come back and touch y'all. I just wanted to come back and to tell y'all that my daughter keep calling me like I ain't grown. Like I can't spend time with myself, I'm spending time with myself. What's wrong with that? Yeah, my lips are so dry and I left my lip gloss. And I meant to look in, in Marshall for some, I forgot all about it because I started looking at other stuff. But anyway, um, I can't be coming on here with dry lips. But anyway, you guys, so I'm about to head across the street to Ross and then we are gonna go to Walmart, pick up our little household stuff and pick up our fruit groceries. Um, I'm on a budget. I budget myself what I want to spend for myself, which I'm staying within that budget. I did good and I'm budgeting um, what I'm going to spend on the household and the groceries. So, yeah, we we, we budgeting, okay? <laughs> All right, y'all. So, yeah, I'm about to, uh, I'm about to uh, head across. The thing I just thought about something when I looked down, y'all, last night I posted a video on YouTube and it was just like an encouraging video y'all when I tell y'all the trolls came out the trolls came out and they was on me one called me said that I was marbly mar mar marbly however you said he said I was a bee obese and one said that I gotta I, he bet I have to turn sideways to walk inside a door I was like oh my god I can't believe I know they come for you and, and you know I hadn't experienced that yet because you know the algorithm or whatever but for some odd reason that video last night hit quick and I, I just started getting negative comments after negative comments people saying that I'm unhealthy how do you know if I'm unhealthy just because I'm heavy set or I'm a full figured woman doesn't mean that I'm unhealthy you know what I'm saying like come again and say what so I had to clap back really nicely with the word of God and let them know that, that that my confidence comes from God. You know what I'm saying? So I just said that to say this, let me encourage you. If you're out there and you're posting and you're trying to grow your channel, you've grown your channel and someone come on your channel with negative comments, hit them back, clap back with the word. Clap back with the word, I promise you. I promise you, they can't top that. Clap back with the word. Don't get discouraged. Let that be your motivation to keep pushing. Because at first it kind of bothered me. Then I had to shake it off. I said, uh-uh. I said, uh-uh. Devil, I buy you in the name of Jesus. Uh-uh. No, you won't bring down my confidence. How far, how hard I have worked and how far I have came. No, nah, we ain't going to do it. So, I don't, yeah, I don't know why I just looked down and it hit my mind about that. I wasn't going to even say nothing about that. Oh, yes, I was or was I? I don't know. Anyway, y'all, so let me go on over here to Ross while I'm just sitting here chilling. The air feels so good. You know, we gonna come back later. Bye, y'all. guys i'm back so i'm gonna do my shopping and um try to concentrate on what i'm doing um
So I'm in Walmart, gonna grab a few things for the house, and just a few households so we can get out of here. Walmart, y'all saw the boogie. Y'all saw the boogie. <laughs> Anyways, so y'all, I got heat in the mouth. Look, I was trying to. It looks so bad. I finna hit go home and put some ice on it, y'all. I was trying to um pull a box of pop torch down, and another box fell and hit me right here. I got hit. <laughs> Y'all see it? It's not real bad, but it's sw it's not real bad, but it's swollen. So I might go put some ice on it. But anyway, you guys, so I am done with shopping for today. I'm getting ready to go home and put these groceries up. I am not. I probably won't. I am gonna do a haul from Marshalls. And Ross, but I'm not gonna do a grocery haul. It's too much stuff, and we ain't doing all that. Y'all saw what was in the book. So, anyway, so I'm gonna um about to go to the house, put these groceries up. Oh, y'all, it hurts. Oh, it hurts. Y'all see the redness? It hurts. I'm about to go put an ice pack on y'all. Oh, I hope that goes down. All right, guys, so we headed to the house. Oh, you guys, I came on here because I finally picked up some of this. It's called Olipop, and it's supposed to be non-GMO. Non this is lemon lime, so it's supposed to be uh, more of a healthy soda, kind of like the poppies. Um, these were like $2.38 a can. Um, I really thought I was picking up the poppies, but this is not the poppies. This is Olipop. So, y'all yeah, see. So, let's taste it. Mm -mm -mm. And y'all yeah, bought three of these. This is nasty. It's 50 calories. Eight percent sugar. Yeah, I can't, I can't see everything because I ain't got. My, hold on, let me put my glasses on so I can see it. What I do? Let me put my glasses on, y'all, so I can see it. So I can tell y'all what it is. Okay. So. It's fifty. The uh, it's fifty calories per serving. It's a total. Total fat is zero percent. Sodium is twenty five milligrams, uh, saying one percent. Total carbohydrates is zero percent. Um, thirty two percent dietary fiber, 
and it includes four grams of added sugar, which is 8%. This is nasty. I wasted my money. It's a, pl a plant, plant powered or pruned, whatever that means. But it's supposed to support your digestive health. It's, it has pro, pro prebiotics in it, botanicals in it, and planted fiber. So, it's nasty. Olipop combines the classic soda you know and love with prebiotics, plant, plant fiber, and botanicals to support your, your microbiome bi, and digestive health finally. Finally, a refreshing soda that's actually good for you. Mm -mm. Nah. Ooh, it tastes like medicine. This is nasty. So I got a strawberry vanilla one and I got a root beer one. So we're gonna see what they taste like. But this one, mm -mm. Mm -mm. this ain't for me. To each his own, but it ain't for me. All right, y'all, let me get to one ahead and drinking this because it's supposed to be good for you. But I'm gonna tell y'all, see, you just don't, it, it only, it, it's not, it has a bad taste when you swallow it. It tastes like medicine, like, like I said, it tastes. So I guess it's because of the prebiotics and stuff that's in it. When you swallow it, but I'm going to drink it because uh, I don't believe in wasting money. So, bon appetit. All right, y'all. I done made it to the house. I'm really thinking about pranking my daughters and telling them that somebody jumped on me in the parking lot because I was parked too close to them. And we was arguing back and forth, and this what took me so long at the store. What y'all think? Y'all think I should do it? That'll be lying, though, won't it? I don't know y'all. I might do it. I might tell them they jumped on me in the park and they hit me in my mouth. Alright y'all, let's get these groceries out. What's up y'all? Hey, I'm back. Made it home. I put up the groceries and did all that. I relaxed a little bit. Y'all gotta excuse me. I done got all out the sprints and everything and everything just hanging all out right now. But anyway, you guys, I wanted to come in really quick and do the little wash and walk home. So... I got picked up these, this glass, this reading glass, eyeglass set from Ross. Um, I use the 150, but you get the glasses and you get a pair of shades and you get a case. And I thought these were so cute because my glasses that I was, um, what's the word I'm trying to say y'all? Subscribed, the glasses that are subscribed, my hair is a mess, they don't work. They gave me the wrong prescription. So I used these, and so I thought these, this was a steal. This was the uh, $9.99. And then I got this one. And this one is Six Sexy Secret Bloom. I love the packaging. Let me show you what the bottle looks like. This smells so good, y'all. I don't have to spray this all over me. So let me see if I can get this box open. This is what the box looks like. And it's by Jean Mark Paris. Smells really good. Smells really good, y'all. Hope y'all can hear me because I'm talking low because I'm trying to make a video in the bathroom. And the other person that I got, y'all. This is the all-time favorite. I can't find it right now. Here it is. The Perialis. This is the small bottle of Perialis 360. I know everybody should know about this. If you don't, you should. You can never go wrong with this. This smell really well. It can sometimes be loud. It just depends on how you wear it. It's a little bottle. And this smells really good. 
So I picked up both of those and I picked up this. So y'all, I've been needing a nighttime routine. So I picked up some things for that. And this is a aloe vera facial cleansing foam. And this one I'm gonna be using at night. So I'm gonna use the facial cleansing foam. And I also have a moisturizing soothing gel mist and you spray this on, on your face. And it's also aloe vera. And I have a aloe vera moisturizing night cream. And so this is by Big Glow and this is by Esfilio. And this one is by Hoka. Holika, Holika, Holika. I really, I was trying to find everything with this, but you know, when you go to Marshalls and place like that, they have everything just all mixed up, everything and all together. So I just got the aloe vera things that I can find. And yeah, so we're gonna go with that. I'm trying to hear up y'all. I ain't want this to be that long. Then, of course, I picked up some other short shorties. These are not the pill and stick, thank the Lord. But I got some more shorties. These are my keys. These are $3.99 and Marshalls. And y'all, I kid y'all not, I was trying to find more than one of these. They only had one, y'all. This is the nourishing body oil, a coconut oil. When I tell you, it smells so good and feels so good on the skin. And I know me, I use oil quick. I use oil, I use a lot of oil. So y'all, I was like, I was really trying to find more than one of these. I was in that store like an hour looking for this. So this is by nature love i'm gonna look this up on the internet y'all i'm gonna look this up online or i'm gonna try another marshall and see if i can find some more because i want some more of these when i tell you i put this on my skin and i love coconut oils it is a coconut oil and it has vitamin e it's coconut oil and vitamin e y'all know i'm a big vitamin e and coconut oil user so you know this was right up my alley so i got this and this is by nourishing it retails at five ninety nine in Marshalls. I don't know how much it costs nowhere else, but this is what it costs there. I just got me a little exploded weight, exploded weighting um, bath sponge, exploder, ex what's wrong with y'all? Tight, exploder, exploding, exfoliating. I got it, exfoliating bath sponge for when I do my sugar scrubs. So I got one of those. And let's see. Oh, and I picked up these. This is a by Ar Argentino Argentino Vivo. And this is just a little anklet. A little length anklet. It do have some thickness to it. That's why I got it. I mean, I love Jerry, especially anklet. I love Jerry, but I, I love anklets. I think it's just one of the most dainty things. And then I got this one, which is a rope. So this one I picked up from Marshalls, you guys. Let me go from there. And then from y'all. I picked up this little cutie right here. Super cute. And this one I told y'all I went, this is what I went for, y'all. Check this out. This is what I went for. And she's a beauty. Hold on. Let me let me get her in here right. I got this y'all because that is my birthstone. And that's what I went back for. I'm surprised they still have it and it's the right size. So those are the things I picked up, y'all. From I don't have I don't have a tripod in here, y'all. So 
you know, the best I can. So I guess I can stand back. Those are the things I picked up from Ross and Marshall's today. And I hope you guys enjoyed the haul. I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. Again, I'm Nikki. I'm Nicole. If you're new and you're watching me for the first time, hey, y'all, hey. Don't forget to hit a like. Comment down below and let me know where you're watching from. If you are my supporter, you are my subscriber, y'all know what's up. Y'all are family. I love y'all. Thank y'all so much. So we're going to end this vlog right here and see you guys maybe tomorrow, maybe not. But peace out. Love you. Bye.